This is how to operate a Cat D6R XL bulldozer. Already got it started. Let it warm up for about 15, 20 minutes. It's already kind of hot outside, so it doesn't take long. Okay, if it wasn't started to start it, here's your parking brake. It's got to be lifted up. Turn the key. Here's the idle up, idle down. You have to hold hold in your de-accelerator right here. If you idle it up. See, I'm holding down the de-accelerator. We're 900 RPM. Start letting it go. Raise it up. Alright. If you have rippers, this lever right here, I can go up and down. This switch right here will make it where this lever doesn't work. Make sure that's unlocked. Now, make sure to get going. Hold your de-accelerator down. Part brake off. Flick it back in reverse. Lift the blade up. Get going. And this one, you got an angle blade. So this switch right here makes the blade go right and left over here. Kind of should be dirt either way. Yeah, of course you got it down, up, and side to side. And that's about it. Just building a pond out here, cleaning up the creek. All right, so from reverse, back down this hill, do accelerator down, apply the brake just slightly coming down the hill, throw it in forward. Kind of hard, I only got one hand to do this, but. Try not to steer. Kind of dig in. Your RPMs will drop and start moving a little slower. Make sure you're seeing quite a bit of dirt pushing out the side of your blade. You ain't doing much. When you feel it start to stop, you just lift up a little bit. Here's kind of what my joystick looks like going through it. So you can see how much you actually move it. That's about it. I'm not even touching the steering. 